I want to describe how I make my reed uh, removal tools, uh, in this case the reed removal pin. They're made from uh, tool steel, which is a high carbon steel that comes uh, in its annealed form, which means it's very soft. It's easy to machine. You grind it into whatever shape you need. And then the next step is to heat it up past 800 degrees. It turns cherry red uh, and it stops being magnetic. We just saw in a little clip a few seconds ago the piece is magnetic. At this point it's cherry red and it's not magnetic anymore. At that point the, 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 the crystalline structure of the carbon uh, and, and the other components line up uh, and, and to preserve the, the way they're lined up you quench it. So you dunk it in oil or water depending on the type of tool steel you have uh, and that preserves that structure and 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 then it's at maximal hardness um, the problem with uh, uh that point that maximal hardness is too hard it's too brittle so what you need to do is do the third step which is you temper it so you heat it back up this time around 300 degrees and you temper it so uh it becomes tough uh so it's it's at the same time hard and flexible so it's tough so it, will, it won't shatter uh, and it'll it'll last forever uh, so what we're going to do what i do is i uh, i temper by color so in a well-lit room you put it under a low flame uh, well you polish it off first and then you put it under a low flame and you can see the color change as the temperature increases and you take it off the flame and right as the point where the the, 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 the color is that brown, that sort of straw colored brown is, is just about to reach the tip. You quench it and you freeze everything uh, right then and there. Then you polish it up again. It's back to its magnetic state and it's hard and tough and it's ready to go. Uh, and I test them by, by banging them uh, and, and, and making them make a hole in, uh, in mild steel. So I know that if the tip doesn't get mangled uh, and they can punch their way into some mild steel, uh, it has been properly uh, executed.